We just launched into a game at Siamese Mahjong. This is the two-player game. Each of us will have two hands. First one with two wins ends the game. That or the tiles in the wall have depleted. Let's see what we can do with these tiles. To sort quickly, hold your shift key down. If you click on a tile, it'll move it to the other rack with the related tiles. And then you can sort. So we have flowers. Definitely going to make a plan to use those. Pair one crack, two five eight, pair of red dragon, white, and pair of west. I think the west already can go. We have no other wins, and we have a pretty healthy grouping of six, seven, eight, nine. Here's one, two. Let's see, we have we have all the ones. I think we should maybe play like numbers with ones. And that category that we have three hands to pick from, we might even be able to use those dragons. And down here, six, seven, six, seven, eight, nine, six, seven, eight, nine. We could play six, seven, six, seven, eight concealed. Let's let the winds go. So we have six, seven, six, seven, eight. That would use the multiples down here. So we'll be able to discard. There's a nine now, though. We'll keep that in mind. So we have a multiple there now. We have one joker, so I don't think I would try a quint. We do have some potential for it. Let's just gather six, seven, eight, nine, Two bamboos. and we'll play with it. Up here, though, look at this like number hand. Two bamboos. There's another flower. Maybe we should play a quint. Four bamboos. We have six, seven, six, seven like numbers with ones. We have the dragons. It'd be nice to use all these flowers. Eight bamboos. Six, seven, eight. All right, so how about, there's another joker. So let's let the five go. Five characters. So let's play a quint up here. Maybe we could play a quint up here. If we get a one crack or a red dragon, we'll be set for a quint. And then play the concealed Nine hand down bamboos. here. There's a two. One, two, one, two we have. Nine, eight, white. Let's let the twos go. Two bamboos. Okay, so I'm thinking maybe the first quint or like numbers with ones. Sounds We're in between. Here's five, six, seven, eight, nine. Five through nine. Two characters. Or six, seven, six, seven, eight crack concealed. We're in between. We really don't need this eight bam, so I think we can let that go. We have a pung of sevens. I don't think I would use this five. Seven characters. Unless, let's hold that dragon. Let's see. There's no all one, all dragon's hand this year. One so let's see. Maybe what we could do is play five, six, seven, eight. Five, six, dot, seven, eight, bam. Six bamboos. There's another green dragon. Okay, let's see. We need to make a choice here. Let's six, seven, eight, green. Let's let the nine dot go. Nine dot. We can still maybe play six seven six seven eight or five six seven eight, or we could play. Nine dots. Now we have that eight now. Nine eight dots. dot. Okay, so here's six seven six seven eight concealed. The pair is secured there. We could do like numbers with ones. Let's see these flowers though. I would really like to use those. Let's wait and see what we can do with these dragons. Seven dots. There's a one dot now. Okay, so let's discard five dot. Five dots. So let's see if we play 
like numbers were set on this hand here. Six characters. We might even be able to do it pure. Let's see. Let's let let's let the eight dot go. Eight dots. All these dragons. Now, what about if we let's see here. One bamboo. Maybe what we could do is play the quint with the seven. Quint with the seven. Wow, look at that. Oh my gosh. Okay, we have to make a choice. Let's let the eight eight bam go. Okay, we're gonna have to make a choice. Here's here's like uh, the dragon hand. Oops. So let's do dragon quint. We'll let these go here. That seems strange here. Okay, six crack we don't need. We can quint the flower, con the white, quint the one, and play the concealed hand down here. Four characters. If we can get another one of these ones, we might be able to use these jokers down here. There's a six dot. We need that for a pung. Let's let the one bam go. One bamboo. We need six bams. One is six out. Six characters. And seven dots. Five one is dots. out. It'd be really nice if we can get ones. Because then we could use these jokers down here. That's one of the nice things about staying concealed, if you can. I Five almost wish we had twos. Well, there's a one. Okay, so now, let's see. Let's discard the green dragon. Three because we might be able to make a pure a pure like number hand. That would be a 50 point hand as opposed to a 40 Five point bamboos. hand. If we can get another Nine one dot characters. and pong this or con this one crack. Nine bamboos. Green dragon. Because we do have the potential for a pure hand right here. Six bamboos. Nine this could bamboos. be pure. The thing about playing like numbers is we'd have to throw away two, two a, pair, a pair of dragons. Or not dragons, flowers. So I think I would probably go ahead and play the quint so we can use all those flowers. So let's, let's commit wind. to the quint up there. We can use this joker down here. And we have joker bait with the red and the one dot. Five bamboos. Three characters. And joker bait, by the way, is a strategy that Tom Sloper developed. There's a link in the video description below to some demonstrations. But basically, you hold pairs you don't need in the hopes of getting a joker in an exposure from one of your opponents. In this case, we have one opponent. So let's see if we can maybe get a joker out of these. Neither are down, so they could be holding them. White dragon. Okay, so we're gonna Kong. We'll just go ahead and commit. Kong. And then we'll let the dragon go first. Red dragon. There was a little hesitation there. Green dragon. This game Four really does keep you on your toes. I find it interesting Four when I hear bamboos. people say that it's too easy. I disagree. Nine it's very characters. challenging. So if you haven't tried it, give it a try. And if you don't have an account at Mahjong Time, look for my email in the video description below. I can send you information about their VIP trial. It's the best place to play online for many reasons. I can tell you about that in the email. I have a whole list of why I think this is the best platform. But trust me, it's the best. I don't want to get too distracted from this hand. 
oh, we have an eight, but we only need a pair there, so we're all right. Red dragon. We'll put that up there, just so we don't make any mistakes. Instagram. So we need help down here. There's a five out. Five. There are two eight bands out and an eight crack. We drew, five. we have a pair here. So really, we're, we're going into the end game, so I think we should discard the riskiest tiles first. No one dots are out, so we should probably Rim discard dragon. those. Let's, I want to keep the one, though, because if we draw all four, oh, either way, we're going to need a joker, though. Let's discard the eight bam. Eight bamboos. So we need a seven dot and six bam. We, we're going to need a, fly, a joker over here for that six bam. Green dragon. Eight bamboos. So we have two disc. Oh no, we have four discards right now. Seven characters. There's a joker. We need that. So let's let the four bam go. Four bamboos. So this hand is one oh yeah one away from ready, but I want to I want to get this quint done because that's the higher point hand. No flowers have been discarded yet. Two characters. Eight dots. Nine bamboos. There's a flower. Let's let the one dot go. One dot. They didn't want it, so that was not good joker bait. <clears throat> So this quint required one joker. That's nice. Because then we could use the other jokers down here. No one cracks are out yet. Of course, we have three. So let's hope it's in the wall. But even as a single Five tile, characters. there's not a lot you can do with a single one. Four dots. I don't. Nope. There's one hand that uses a one. A no two. Oh. Two hands use a single one. Two Four hands characters. use a single one. I think that would be Nine dots. that would be the six hand down under consecutive run one and dot. and odds concealed. One so dot. they could potentially have the one crack Seven in one of their characters. hands. I'm hoping that we can draw Nine it. <clears throat> we could mahjong if we bring one of these jokers up. One character. There it is. Okay, so we'll mahjong on that now. Mahjong. And then we'll discard the wind. We'll see if we can get the second Mahjong. So this is going to be a staggered win. The first hand is the value of the hand. And the second Two win, characters. if we get it, will be double value. Seven characters. The second win would be double value. And this is concealed. So we're going to need to win. draw a keeper in. We did. So More we are win. ready to win on a seven dot. Nine characters. Ready to win on a seven dot. And there's Three one dots. one out. So ready to win seven dot for the second hand. And that will be double value. So that'll be a 60 point hand. Which is nice. Two characters. If we can get it. So let's just hope for safe Four discards. Figures. Because they could double Mahjong at any time. Three dots. This is a good discard. Four. Characters. Right now we are ahead because we have the only winning hand visible. So if we get a risky tile, we might break up this hand instead of discarding the risky tile. 
because we're ahead Seven right now. Bamboos. Five crack is out, so I'd say that's a good discard. Five characters. Even though we're ready to win, we're in the lead at the moment. One bamboo. Oh, there's a six ban. I thought they were all out, so we got it. Self pick, double mahjong, or not double mahjong. This is a staggered win. Both hands. So we'll get single value for the top one and double value for the second one. And we self picked it. And let's go see what the other player was working on. We have two, four, six, eight, ready to win on a six dot. And then like numbers with threes. And they were hoping for double mahjong on that six dot. So they held off to declare this, this is a winning hand, or one of these is actually a winning hand if they just used a joker to declare it. And it's their prerogative. They, they might have held on for double mahjong because of the quint. There's a couple ways you can think of it. First, with two 25 point hands, the only way they would be able to overtake the quint is winning both of them. So if they declared Mahjong for one of these hands, that would be a single value hand for 25 points. The other, if they did win it staggered, that would be a 50 point hand. So that would be a 75 point hand. So if they did that, they would have overtaken one quint. So it's really six one half dozen the other, but if you declare a winning hand, especially if another player has a declared hand out, you'll get value and it'll add to your ranking if you're trying to rank up. In this case, they're a, a brown belt with a black stripe. So I might have considered declaring a win for that so I could get the value in that particular case. But they might have been trying to do double mahjong. They were ready to win uh, double mahjong. So I, I would be tempted to, to go that route. The challenge here is we were playing a concealed hand and we had the sixes. So they were gonna need another joker. They have four, five in their hand and we have three. This was an interesting game. Like I said earlier, if you haven't tried it, give it a try. It'll keep you on your toes. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, consider subscribing. Click that little gray bell if you do. That way you'll get notification for when I post new videos and you won't miss an opportunity to learn a new strategy or pick up an insight to the game that could give you an advantage at the table. Between now and the next video, may all your picks be keepers.